The live fish vending machine is known for giving us some amazing fish. This vending machine has been a staple on the channel for quite some time, so we're making the journey back all the way down south to see what we can get out of it today. If it's anything like how the past few times went, you guys know it's gonna be insane, so let's do it. We're strolling up to the vending machine now. You guys already know we had a pull up with a fat stack of ones, ladies and gents. Sadly, they got no shiners today, so that means no fish feeding, but they have a good variety. We got the saltwater fish, mystery fish, and of course, the do not press. We're kicking things off with a saltwater fish. Oh, it makes me so excited. Every time this thing drops out a nice live fish pod. Here we go, we got another saltwater fish here, and then we're making our way to the mystery fish. Who knows what it'll be today? Could be a Loch Ness Monster. Finally, the one you guys have been waiting for, the Do Not Press. Let's head home and let's see what the vending machine has for us today. We have made it back from the vending machine. Woo! I got my Respect the Reef hat on and my Respect the Reef shirt on. I've got my Fish Guy hat on that's completely sold out, but is getting new ones made soon, so stay tuned. Cross your fingers. Guys, if you don't follow us on Instagram, go follow us on Instagram and check out fishguy.shop because we just made the most epic <laughs> Respect the Reef Epic commercial. Now let's get into our first tote of the day. We got a total of four. I'm feeling lucky. Optimistic here. I think we might be striking gold in one of these. Okay. Like I'm talking baby golden puffer. That's, mm. that's what I'm talking <gasps> Alright, let's see if it's that's in this that's, first one. Let's see gold. if it's in this first one. What is that? What is that? What is that little guy? We're gonna have to take that out. He's colorful. He's definitely about to kind of a brute. We got some spots on him. Is that a saltwater fish or a freshwater fish? I can't tell, honestly. I think we need to maybe grab is him it out. a type of uh, ras? You know, it does look like a ras. It ass. looks like a bit of a ras, colorful little guy. I think we need, should, should probably take him out. We should put him in that. All, All right, right, let's, let's find see. out what this thing is. What do we got here? What is that? Yep, yeah, that's, oh, that's confirmed. A saltwater fish, I think. Can we smell? It's really salt. Salt. That's a saltwater fish. It's a ras. Dude, oh, that thing is sick. That thing is sick. Such a sick pattern on him. Look at that thing. That thing is wild, bro. Blue and black and red on the fins. That thing is bad to the bones. Add him in. There he goes. You Guys, check out that fish. Another awesome fish added to the mini predator tank. This guy has got some really good color. Honestly, as you look at him swim, he's got a different way of swimming than the rest of the fish. He stands out from the rest of the crowd, and I think he's going to really brighten up. Once he's not as stressed, and he's gonna look really good inside there. I would because, say, yeah, that, that was a pretty solid fish. If I'm a teacher, You're I'm giving it, it five out of I'm 10. giving it a 79%. Mm, passing. Okay. It's a passing good. grade, but it's not a B, which is every average man and woman's dream. <laughs> to just get high C's. And high C's, C's, C's get degrees, y'all. Take C's that from Fish Guy Jack. Your parents might not like it, but guess what? We all get the same diploma at the end of it. <laughs> Jack. <laughs> You guys think Jack's a full-time fish guy. This man is a full-time college student. College is super important, guys. What's the class called? I don't even know. <laughs> Organic literature. Literally don't even know. Don't know where it is, who the professor is. Going literally with nothing. So. Okay. <laughs> All right, here we go. Here we go. Ready? Here we, here we go. go. Come on. Come on. Come on. Talk to me. What the? What is what that? Is that? <laughs> What is that? That is... I should take him to my science class. It literally looks like a skeleton. We, we have to take him out. Guys, what do you think of this goatee? Seriously. It's gonna catch me a while. I don't think this is a saltwater fish. No, fresh. Guys, look at that weirdo right there. Honestly, that is a weird looking fish. He's got whiskers coming out of his nostrils. Talk about some long nose hair. Guys needs a trim I think for he's sure. invisible, bro. Put, turn him on his side. That thing is invisible. Oh my invisible. god, he's invisible. I don't like him. I don't like him. It's a ghost fish. I don't like him. I'm grading that again. I'm the teacher of the day. 51%. Ooh. We got a 79%, we got a 52%. We're averaging 69, 81, 131, divide that by 2, 65.1. Third tote, let's hope it's a little bit higher of a grade. What do we got? Ooh, Ooh I like that. Okay, okay. I like that. Okay. That is a cleaner Hit rats. Hit That is a cleaner rats. I actually know what this fish is. They're actually super important to have in the hobby. You know why, Chris? Why? Tell them why. Because they're the, actually the doctors of the fish world. They're actually the doctors of the fish world. You put him in a tank with ick, with velvet, with <laughs> flukes. He will go around and eat the parasites off the fish. So now, it's a symbiotic relationship. Now the cool thing about this guy is actually he's got a golden head. I actually just got one Salt. of these over at my house. I just picked up one of these over my house and it does not have a gold head. It has just a white head. Now the thing is you might think, oh my God, I'm, it's risky putting him in with a big giant fish. But fish know deep down, this guy's here to help. I mean, he's swimming around in there. Happy-go-lucky dude. I'm pumped about this guy. <laughs> Clean up on 
Sorry. I just lost my gallon. <laughs> Just Not spill so all bad. the water from the rug. You guys don't even know what's in this rug. Thousands and thousands of gallons of water have been soaked into this rug. I just want to let everyone know. All right, we're going to get this guy in the tank. Here he goes. See you, buddy. Oh, oh let's go, baby. Baby. Let's go. This tank's coming along really nice. we got some awesome mini monsters in here. And there he goes. I think he knows. He knows better. He knows See, better. See, the Emperor Snapper just went right up to him, looked at him, and said, we are friends. We are, you are not my food. Fish are friends. So this guy's gonna do great in here with all of our little mini monsters in here. We got the little cool awesome grouper and we got the emperor snapper. We got the sweet lips, we got the hogfish, and we got the awesome hyphen snapper. All these little little dudes in here are kicking ass. I love this tank. I can't wait to grow them up and transfer them to the pond. Let's get into tote number four. Let's see what it is. The last tote! tote! Do not press and do not open. Good luck. Lord have mercy. If you're a fish guy right now, comment down below, fish guy for life! <laughs> and go check out fishguy.shop! Yeah! I respect the reef. Respect that reef hat. Stay tuned for new freaking uh, designs because we are dropping some bangers. Bangers. We're, bangers. we're constantly working, guys. This ain't YouTube merch. It's a full-blown store brand, baby. Yep. Going to the moon. Yes, sir. And we're opening the Do Not Press here. As you guys know, we've gotten some insane things in the past. We've gotten literally tarantulas. We've gotten, I think, a scorpion once. We've gotten some crickets. We've got some insane fish. We also did get a shark egg as well. And now, here we go with the Do Not Press. Well, my fish guy radar do some detecting here. It's gonna be a freshwater fish. Is your fish guy radar going? Eh, it could be a saltwater. Is your fresh? Could be brackish though. I'm getting mixed radars. Three, Talk. two, and one. Oh! Woo! Look at that little guy. That's a that's a huma huma. That's a huma huma baby. I always love these dudes. Dude, that thing is sick. That thing is sick. Guys, this fish is beautiful. The blue on him, the orange, the white. He's a perfect size. He's literally going perfectly inside of the mini predator tank. I mean. Obviously, you can't get too big of a fish inside of something like this, but this is a perfect fish. Predator added to the collection. I was expecting something crazier, but I think it's a stellar fish. I'm going to give it a 8.5. All right, here he goes. There you go, buddy. Let's go, baby. Epic new fish, bro. Look at him swimming around the rocks there. We got a new trigger, a new ras, a new cleaner ras, two rasses. Yeah, two rasses. Double and glass. that glass catfish, what a random fish. Guys, another fish vending machine. If you guys want to see more vending machine videos, all you gotta do is hit the like button and we'll make it happen again. You guys seem to love them, so we're gonna keep doing them as long as you guys want to see them. Stay tuned, subscribe, and the notification bell on, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Later. Fish guys out.